What are I get about WWE is that um they choose to not listen to the fans. But the fans have a re- have a very good point on what they're gonna say. Because what they're doing they're trying to convince the WWE to bring the old wrestlers back. Wrestlers like Braun Strowman, Hulk Hogan. Well, he already has come back, but to host WrestleMania, I think he should host more shows. Um, the Usos, the Usos, the Usos. One thing they should bring back is the Usos. And, I, and I'll tell you why, shall I? Is because they were the greatest tag team alive, and not and not just that. It was also and not just that. It was they were the most popular tag team in the industry. Not not just because they won so many title belts in one day. It's because they were the top tag team. They were the top. I don't know. They were the top tag team of all tag teams. Because they kept going. They kept going. They kept going. But WWE decided to break that. WWE decided to get rid of the good wrestlers and bring some crappy new ones in. Well, I'll I'll tell you this now, WWE. If you don't buck up your ideas, you will go out of business fast. Because you are silly for getting rid of all Massive wrestlers in the industry. Now I can understand why he got rid of Riddle because he was on cocaine. I I, I can understand that. I can understand that. But people like Kevin Owens. Now there's been storylines about Kevin Owens about WWE trying to release Kevin Owens. No. Uh -uh. Won't work. You need WWE. You know what you need? A good kick up the butt. Where it hurts. The most least paying person that should be least paid right now is Roman Reigns. You should make a storyline. Come WrestleMania 40. You should make a storyline about Roman Reigns. Losing at WrestleMania. Because everyone else can. The cre- the, the, the storylines are created by creators, right? They, they sort out. They, they make the storylines. The creators make the storylines. But that needs to stop. Michael Cole is annoying because he has this little voice coming out of his headset telling him what to say on the commentary table. No. No, 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 no. Eh, eh. That should stop. Because I don't know if that's true that that Vince McMahon, well, it was Vince McMahon, that Triple H is telling Michael Cole and Wade Barrett and Kevin Patrick and Corey Graves what to say, or they've got a script right in front of them on the desk. In the bam. That's what I think that's happened. Michael Cole's got a script laid down in front of him, te- wrote, written down, was, t- was telling him what to say. 
Not this little voice coming out of his headset. I think it's both. Michael Cole's reading the script at the same time, and then Triple H is adding on to the script. Michael Cole is a play-by-play -play commentator. He doesn't need telling what to do, mate. One commentator you should get rid of is Kevin Patrick. No offence, Kevin, but you need training, mate. I think you need to go to NXT and get training with Booker T. If you want WWE, if you want to stay in business, I suggest you sort yourselves out, mate. Because you ain't getting nowhere. Hunter, you better deal with this, mate, because you, your business is going to go out of business. I'm telling you, you are not going to win. Do I say in 20, 30 years, you guys will go bankrupt? That's what I think. And Vince McMahon sold WWE to UFC for a reason. So they could fight like UFC fighters. UFC fighters fight. They don't get told what to do. They fight and they punch. They don't get told, mate. Oh, they don't get told. They don't get told what to do. And they put their, f they they step what they they put their foot in their oxygen and they're fighting like no one's business. Bang bang bang, fish flying, mate. Jimmy Smith, Jimmy Smith. Now I don't have a problem with Jimmy Smith. I don't. I have a problem with Jimmy Smith. Jimmy, come back, mate. You are the right person for all. And you will be right for SmackDown. Come back to WWE. Hunter, bring Jimmy Smith back to the commentary table. Bring him back. Jimmy, come back to WWE, mate. You were so much better. You were... WWE suited you. Michael Cole, it suits you. It suits you a lot. You don't need, you don't need nobody telling you what to do. None of that. Oh, 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 Kevin Owen. No, man. You've lost your time. Jimmy Smith, you need to come back. Otherwise, I'll tell you now, you, you should replace Kevin Patrick on the commentary table. You should be with Corey Graves. You and Corey Graves would do well together. Leave Michael Cole where he is. He is best suited on Raw. Tom Phillips. Tom Phillips. Where's he gone? Oh, that's right. He was released. He was released. Now someone, to, now someone come and explain to me why... Jimmy Smith. No, sorry. Tom Phillips was released. Was he released? Or did he just, or did he just leave? I don't think he left. I think he was released. Jimmy Smith. J Tom Phillips went to impact wrestling. It shocks you, doesn't it? I know. Josh Matthews went to Impact Wrestling. I can go on. Todd Grisham. Don't know. Most, cert most certain of all, Jerry the King Lawler. Jerry the King Lawler, he is 70 years old. 70 years old. Who, who thinks that Jerry the King Lawler has 
still got that commentary left in him. Oh, I think he has. He has got one bit of commentary left in him. Michael Cole, you've been doing this for years. So, Michael, if you're watching this, mate, comment. Comment. You should bring... You're, you're the head of commentary. Why don't you bring... Why don't you convince Triple H to bring Tom Phillips back? And Jimmy Smith back? You're the head of commentary. You go and tell him, mate. You stay where you are. You're best seated on the roll. Wade Barrett. You should become a wrestler again. Bring the former Nexus back to laugh. There it was. You were in WWE for years. You were wrestling for years, and then you just and then you decided to blow it up. What good does that make? I'll tell you now, WWE. If you don't back up your ideas, you're gonna go bankrupt. The only the only promotion I can see lasting now is Ring of Honor. Yokozuna. If he was still alive now, he'd be pushing people out of the ring. He did sumo wrestling in Japan. How's that? <laughs>